Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to walk you through the steps on how you can get an ECG on your Google Pixel Watch. So what we want to do is click the crown on the side to open up our apps, and then we're going to scroll down to find the Fitbit ECG option. It's right there. So we're going to click on it. And to get this up and running, we're going to set it up on our phone. So to get started, open the Fitbit mobile app. So we click open on our watch. And taking you over to my phone, this opens us up to the heart rhythm assessment. Now, if you don't already have Fitbit set up on your phone, I'll have a separate tutorial video linked down in the description if you want to walk through the steps on setting up Fitbit. But I'm making the assumption that you've already set up Fitbit on your phone and hooked it up with your Pixel Watch. And it says this is designed to check for AFib and irregular heart rhythm. It takes a 30-second reading with the ECG app on your Fitbit device. And then you can generate a PDF of your results to share with a healthcare professional. So then we can click get started at the bottom. You need to confirm that you're at least 22 years old. You don't have a pacemaker. You understand this assessment can't detect heart attack, blood clots, stroke, or other heart conditions. And understand that this assessment isn't a diagnosis. So if you confirm this, you can click I confirm at the bottom. And if you agree to the privacy policy, you can click I agree at the bottom. The rhythm that your heart makes can be detected by the electrical sensors on the device. And this data is analyzed for signs of an irregular heart rhythm. So again, we can click next. Then it's showing you what a normal rhythm looks like and what AFib looks like. And if your heart rate is over 120 beats per minute or under 50 beats per minute, then the heart rhythm assessment can't assess your heart rhythm. So again, click next. So we want to wear our device snugly, but with enough room for comfort. Let it sit a finger width above your wrist bone. So now we're ready to go and try it on our device, so we can click done. And going back to our watch, clicking the crown button, and then again going down to find the Fitbit ECG, click on that. And to take the heart rhythm assessment, we can click ready. And the device is on my left wrist, so I'm gonna click that. Have a seat, try to relax, keep your hands still. So I'm sitting. And we need to allow the app to access our sensor data, so we can click allow. And it says rest your finger lightly on the face of the crown. Don't touch wrist or watch with other fingers. So we're going to lightly put our finger on the crown and we're going to keep our finger still. And you need to do this for the 30 seconds. So then it says data collected and it says for me a normal rhythm and we can look over the information here. Your heart rhythm appears to be normal and then some additional information that you can look through. You can download a PDF of your results from the Fitbit mobile app. And at the bottom, we can click done. So I hope this video is helpful walking you through the steps on how to use the Fitbit ECG app in your Pixel Watch. I appreciate you guys stopping by. Consider subscribing to the YouTube channel and I'll catch you back here next time.